Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my Dollar Tree haul. Dun, da, da, da. Um, you guys know that I always say the same thing. I'm so excited to share with you the stuff that I got. This is like a collective Dollar Tree haul. I've gone a couple of times over the past couple of weeks and I'm going to show you everything that I got. If you guys did not see my follow me around video, I will have it linked down below. I go around my Dollar Tree and I get stuff there so you can see some of the stuff that I brought in that video. But there is other stuff that I'm going to show in this video. I just want to give a humongous hey girl hey to um, a subscriber that I met at my favorite Dollar Tree. This is like my local Dollar Tree. And she came up and said hello to me. I looked a mess. I was probably awkward as all heck. And I was just in shock and so excited to meet somebody that watches my videos that is gorgeous and has the same interests as I do. It was like... I don't know, it was like so exciting. I've been talking about it for the past couple of days. I was so nervous that I didn't even ask her her name. So if you are watching, I want to say hi. Thank you so much for saying hello to me. It was amazing to meet you. You are gorgeous. And it was really fun just shopping around the Dollar Tree with you. We just like were looking all around together. And I was with my family, so, you know, I had to keep an eye on them. But it was so amazing to meet you. I just want to say thank you and hi. And I hope that I get to see you again. I'm going to share with you guys a great collective haul. If you guys want to see, then just keep watching. So as I always do, I always start with the thing that I was most excited about. And I am going to start with the makeup stuff first, but I'm going to share with you the thing that I was most excited about. And it wasn't makeup this time. It was actually a cookbook. And this is the real simple, easy, delicious home cooking cookbook. And for like 5.2 seconds, the Dollar Tree had an abundance of cookbooks, like a ton of them, like really good ones. They had like grilling ones, drink ones, they had a whole bunch of different ones. But I picked up this one because you guys know I'm simple, I'm easy. I'm all about easy and simple and this has a variety of like summer, winter, fall recipes and it even has some dessert ones in there. So um, the pictures in here are absolutely gorgeous. Um, if you guys read this magazine or I believe it's a magazine, real simple. Yeah, they always have like really nice, clean, simple stuff and I really like that. So I'm excited to give some of these recipes a try. A lot of them don't have a ton of ingredients and I can't do too good with too many ingredients. So if it's easy, I can do really well with it. I can follow a recipe really well and recreate it. But when it has too many ingredients and things like that, I get a little worked up. So... Um, this will be good. Have you guys picked up any of the cookbooks? Let me know in the comments down below what you guys picked out because they had a ton of different ones, but I only picked up this one. So the next thing I found was makeup, and I've shared these before. I did get a few of them. I got four in total. I got um, three of the 190 Revlon um, Nearly Naked, and I got one of a darker shade. I believe it was 260 Caramel. I'm wearing them both today. I shared them in the video when I did a full Dollar Tree makeup look. I will have that link down below. My face that I have on now is these Nearly Naked, and they are really good. Next thing that I picked up were the Maybelline Color Tattoos Pigments. These are loose powder pigments. They're not the cream formula that the other ones are, so they're not a good base. They are super glittery, like chunks of glitter. If you don't want glitter, stay away from these. I will show you swatches of all of them. Um, I picked up Buff and Tough. Um, downtown brown and downtown brown is my favorite it beats all of the other ones that I have used I haven't opened a few of these because they're really bright colors but I really like downtown brown I thought that I was really going to like buff and tough but surprisingly I don't and then there's this really pretty fuchsia one and this one is called pink rebel It, this one is a black one, and this is called Black Mystery. And this one looks like it could be really pretty. Really try not to use too much glitter. If I do use a glitter pigment or something like this, I always wet the brush first so that it's a damp brush and it helps with the fallout. Um, but these are super glittery, and they're okay, but I would highly recommend picking up the Downtown Brown, which is the dark brown color. The next makeup item I picked up were the Milani Shadow Eyes, and I have a ton of them. This one is the brown one, and it's called Brown Deluxe, and it's a pretty color. Um, it's alright. I have not used it or tried it. The next thing that I picked up is this e.l.f. Clarifying Pressed Powder, and this looks really good, and the color looks good. It has um, salicylic acid in it, and it says it helps for the treatment of acne, and it will help prevent new blemishes. This reminds me a lot of the Neutrogena Healthy Skin type products that they sell where it's supposed to help your skin. 
Um, the color looks like it could be okay. It's called light beige, and we will see um, what what this does on my skin. The next thing that I picked up is an e.l.f. Um, foundation brush. I picked up the other one from Wet n Wild, and it was okay, but the packaging on this looks really nice. Like, look at this handle. Packaging is like the nice e.l.f. professional foundation, the professional line. So these are normally $3.00 at Target or online, so for a dollar that's a good deal, so I picked it up. So the next thing I picked up are two of these hair masks. The one is in argan oil and the other one is in coconut oil. These are um, deep conditioners that you keep on your hair for like a treatment for your hair. Um, and I have not used some, it says to leave on for 10 minutes. I will definitely be using these and letting you know my opinion on them in a video in the future. The next beauty-ish thing that I picked up is this Via Natural Ultra Care Argan Oil, and this is concentrated natural oil, and I have been using this. You guys can see a lot of it is gone. I have been using this like crazy. Um, I use it on my cuticles. I use it a little bit on my hair. If like my ends look super dry, I just run it through the bottoms of my hair. I have been using this stuff like crazy, especially like for my cuticles. When I do my nails and I give myself a manicure, I just put this oil on my fingers and it has been good. I would highly recommend picking this up. I so the next thing, it's like more medication than so much beauty. This is going to be, the rest of this stuff is going to be like miscellaneous miscellaneous stuff. But I was able to pick up this Airborne Dual Action Beta Immune Booster and Antioxidant Power. So when you feel like you're about to get sick, especially with these winter months coming, you take one of these and it will boost your vitamins, your immune system, so that you can fight, your body can fight the cold. 500 milligrams of Beta Immune Booster, high antioxidants, 500 milligrams of vitamin C, is an excellent source of zinc and selenium. So for a dollar, this is a good deal. So on drugstore.com, this retails for $13.99. Um, so go get you some, guys. $13.99 to help save yourself from a cold. So the next thing that I picked up is sort of, kind of, you know, I don't know if I should be sharing it or if it's like TMI, but this is the Dorax Real Feel um, Long Lasting Sensual Feel with Silicone. This is Intimate Pleasure Gel. Um, now... I'm not saying that you should go out and run and get this. There was a whole lot of controversy on the Dollar Tree group if you should be posting stuff like this. I feel like this. We are all grown. I'm letting you know what they had at my store. If you guys want to go pick this up for yourself, you're more than welcome to. If you don't, then you don't have to. We are all grown here. If you are not grown, you might want to click out. They sell it at Walmart. They sell it at Target. If you don't want to see it, then... I'm sorry. But this is a really good deal dollar-wise. This Durex um, retails for about $13 at Walmart, and I was able to find it at mine for a dollar. So I saw these two new candles, and they come from the brand Old Williamsburg Candle Corporation. And I got, they had a few different scents. I only picked up this scent, which is cranberry. And in a small space, I have already burnt one. I picked up three. The one worked really well in my kitchen, so in a smaller space, my living room area is like open, so the smell, you aren't able to smell it really well, but in my kitchen, which is like an enclosed space, it smelled really nice. So it doesn't have a really strong smell, but it does have a smell, and for a dollar, I thought that the packaging was really cute. I picked up two of the Gain um, dishwashing soaps, and I'm already using one, and this is for... 414 milliliters or 14 ounces and it says it's 50% more. This is the biggest bottle that I've ever saw at the Dollar Tree. They're actually stepping up their game on size. So I was really excited to pick this up. I did pick it up instead of my Dawn Platinum trial size. The next thing I picked up is this little bowl. Quincy loves these bowls with the straws. Um, it says it's, this one is BPA free. It says it on the box and it says that it's um, dishwasher safe. But I try not to put these in the dishwasher because of this little straw. I like to really soak it so that it doesn't get all that milky grossness in it. Um, but these are great. My kids love these. And he loves to suck the milk out of the cereal. So I picked up another one for Quincy. The next thing that I picked up is this Comet Multi-Surface Spray Cleaner in Lilac Bliss. And we hadn't used this before in our bathrooms and things like that. And it works really well. So I picked up another one. So I plan on, um, like sprucing up my little washer area. Um, it's just like a little closet where the washer and dryer is, so by no means is it a laundry room, but it is like a laundry closet. So I picked up three of these white buckets. 
um, that I'm going to use to hold towels and things like that. So I'll, I'm going to use these in our laundry room area. And I think that they are nice. The quality of them is really good. And the color of them is so crisp and white. I really liked that. The next thing I picked up was for Bobby for school. And it is a fork and a spoon. And I thought this would be good to pack for his little lunches. And the last thing is this tempura paint. So when they had all of the cookbooks, they had a whole bunch of this tempura paint. And I picked this up for a dollar. This is a large size. Um, it's two ounces of gold glittery paint. So this was a good deal, I thought. So the hidden word for this video is going to be play, P-L-A-Y. Leave that word in the comments down below, and I will feature one comment in the next video. So the comment that I'm going to highlight from my last Dollar Tree haul is... I don't think I had any hidden word from that comment, so I'm just going to highlight a few of the comments. I believe it says, Folarache Jerry. I'm sorry if I say, I'm saying that wrong. I apologize. Um, she said, enjoyed your haul. Thanks for sharing. Lovely and beauty. Great Dollar Tree haul. And then Ashley Hobbs. Awesome haul. Thanks for sharing. I heard a lot about Scentbird. Seems really great. So, yeah, we talked about Scentbird. I always have the link to Scentbird down below in my description box of all of my videos now. So if you guys want to check them out, somebody actually told me that when you use that link, you get, you get the first month, you pay for the first month, and the second month you actually get free. So if you are looking for buy one, get one free, check out Scentbird because with that link down below, it is allowing you to get one month free. So thank you so much for everybody that's leaving a comment. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I love you all from the bottom of my heart. If you aren't subscribed, please hit that subscribe button because it'll make me happy. I love you all so very much. I hope you're having an amazing day, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.